What's up everybody? It's Cameo Finance and I'm here to talk to you about Star Atlas, which is a NFT game coming to the metaverse and it's set to be similar to Eve Online, which is a uh, outer space strategy game um, with a really, really detailed economy. There's things like mining and bounties and missions and uh, all kinds of different things that can uh, that really contribute to a really active economy. I'll just say that. Um, so they had a really cool trailer that came out. Uh, we'll go ahead and watch the trailer now together. Legend has it that somewhere on the other side of space is a diamond the size of a planet. So yeah, you can see it's on Solana, Star Atlas, uh, the Serum Exchange is listed there as a partner as well. So we'll go ahead and close that up. Um, you can see the website here, and scroll to the top, so vast world beyond imagining, depths of the universe, going to get a spaceship, and you can join a faction. So pretty cool uh, if you've ever played. EVE Online or some type of interstellar, interstellar strategy game is going to be similar to that. Um, this is what their market looks like on their official site. So here's a skin that I bought today. And I'll kind of go guide you through the process. As you can see they have things for trade here. Some of these ships are going to come on sale in like two days. But I just bought a skin. Um, we'll go to the marketplace. So this is the Nanobyte skin or the little hover bike that they got there. And I paid about $99 for the asking price. Um, I didn't place a bid on it right now. The, the highest bid is about $60. Bucks. Um, again, this game is in development, so these skins are not going to be able to be used for a while. But uh, I just figured I'd test out the Solana and buy an NFT. Um, so this website doesn't work so good if you're on a VPN. So if I turn off my VPN and refresh, I'm going to load up the prices there, so there we go. Selling for $98. And um, if you want to buy one, you just click here. You click the lowest price one. You can choose, I just want to buy one of those. You click buy it now. Um, inside your Solana wallet, if you have Solana in there and you don't have USDC, you can just go to this little trade tab, click Solana USDC. So let's say we want 100 bucks. There we go. We can just review it, and it'll cost like 20 cents for that transaction estimated fee. Look at that. It's not even one cent. So super cool. Um, and yeah, so once I bought it, I was super confused because when I went over to NFTs, this was empty. It says you have no collectibles. And so I went to the Discord and I asked around and eventually someone in the chat um, sent me the FAQ somewhere on their Discord. I'm not going to find it now, but that led me to this Google Doc. I'll link this in the description below, but this is super important. Um, essentially, you're going to go to the DEX at Project Serum. So click on that. Or I have it open. Okay, just copy that. This is the Google Trends. Look at people are going to search for Star Atlas starting today. But this is Project Serum DEX right here. Um, once you get to this page, uh, it'll say this site is not available in your region. So you do have to have a VPN if you want to mess around on here. So now I'm connected from Switzerland. And it'll allow me to access the site. From here, you click on Trade. If it's not already selected, for me it's already selected. Then you go over and click on this little plus button. You can add a custom market, and on that Google Doc, 
you can see there's a market ID, a market label, and a base label. So whatever NFT that you bought on the market, see here we have the posters, um, the ships, we have the ship skins. Um, so you'll copy down the market ID, paste it in there. It's not gonna, it's gonna say unknown token, don't worry about that. Copy down this next one. It's gonna be the market label, and then this third one is gonna be the base ID. Boom, and then you'll just click add. I already have that added into my system, but uh, yeah, once that's added on there, um, you can connect your wallet, go to balances, here's your wallet balances. Sometimes it'll glitch out and like kick you out, um, but you can just keep on, you know, disconnect, reconnect, go to balances. So yeah, this is all very new. If you think that you're too late on the train for Solana, like every all the exchanges here are super buggy still, and um, some of these projects are still kind of catching their stride. Um, so very new ecosystem. Not all these things are going to work all the time. But just to kind of, since I can't get it to work for me, there it is. So it'll show up your tokens like that. And let's get all these out of the way. Um, you'll sh it'll show your tokens and then you'll just click settle all funds and then you'll pay a little transaction fee but then you go over, not to your MetaMask, but after I did that I clicked settle all funds, I went over and my collectible was in my wallet. So if you are trying to buy assets on Star Atlas right now and they're not showing up in your NFT wallet, this is how to solve that problem. Um, if this was helpful to you in any way, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. I'm coming to you uh, every single week with NFT news and helpful tips just like this. So uh, yeah, here we go, my wallet finally loaded in. But yeah, you'll just click settle all funds, boom. It didn't even cost anything. Um, but yeah, thank you again for checking out the video. Uh, it truly does support me every time that you watch these videos. So I appreciate you for being here and I'll see you in the next video.